Quadcopters have four propellers and hexacopters have six. What would happen if you put a fifth propeller and a fifth motor on the quadcopter though? Of course, not on the same plane as the rest of the propellers. That would not work. You need the same number of clockwise and counterclockwise rotating propellers to maintain the stability. But the fifth one in the back, pushing the quad forward, that might be interesting. Some time ago I built such a contraption. It was just a standard quad with the fifth pusher prop in the back. When the fifth propeller was off it was just another quadcopter. Absolutely nothing different from any other quadcopter in the world. But because the fifth motor was controlled by one of the switches on the radio, when you flip the switch the quadcopter immediately converted itself into the screamer. <laughs> Instead of flying like a quadcopter, when you want to go forward, you have to pitch forward, the controls were now basically like on any other airplane. You're going forward no matter what's happening, you control roll and yo for direction, and you control pitch for the altitude. Of course, you still had to use throttle to maintain the altitude, because the propellers were not providing any kind of the lift only because of the fact that the whole contraption was moving forward, but the controls were now much closer to the airplane controls than to the quadcopter controls. As a result, I built a quite a fun to fly device. Bear with me for a second. It was a super fun device to fly, mainly because of the sound it was making. However, it was not better than the quadcopters or fixed wing airplanes. Why? Because it inherited almost all the flaws of the drone quadcopters. You had to spin all the four motors to keep this thing into the air and it was not generating any lift only because of going through the air, but also controls got slightly complicated and the thing got heavier, so it was not better than the fixed wings as well. However, it was fun. Yes, I know, years ago there was such a thing as Foxeer Screamer. The only difference was that the Screamer was made by the real company and my contraption was made by me. But besides that, almost exactly the same. And now I know, yeah, the pentacopters are not really the next best thing. Fun? Definitely. But most probably fun is the only advantage of those contraptions. If you would like to build something similar yourself, in the description description there is a link to the STL file for the conversion kit. Works like a charm with the Martian 2 frame, but with small adjustments should work with almost everything out there. What do you think about drone like that? Drop your thoughts into the comments. If you would like to see some other experimental flying devices I've built over the years, here's the video for you. I'm Paweł Spychalski, thank you very much for watching and happy flying!